Hello again, fourth video devlog for Fortify 2. And uh, once again, I've made some pretty nice progress. Um, you can see the fog of war I've added. Um, so I'll just start playing immediately. I will try to keep the video a little bit shorter. <clears throat> so, as you can see, I'm still playing the first mission. You saw this in the last devlog. Made some improvements though. And uh, well, the wall sprites are updated, for example. Um, I've made a wooden palisade. And um, this is a bit like Fortify 1, um, where you start with a little wooden palisade. Uh, it's pretty bad. And uh, uh, later on in the game you get better and better uh, wall types. So, attacking units. I've added some combat texts, like, so when every time they do damage, the number pops up. So let's, let's move away a few, so we can see when they hit the castle. So again, if I hold this button, you can see they start attacking. Let's let him destroy it. <clears throat> so we made it through, and this is the goal he's trying to get to. I'll change this to something more important later. There we go. I'll just rebuild this. You won't be able to rebuild it in, in the real version. So that's <clears throat> first mission. I'll just move my hero. So I've changed him to blue color because I want him to be he's an ice mage, ice slash water mage. You'll see what I mean. I've added some spells. And here added some water. Move. So this is now level two, which uh, is pretty much done, but there is no level 3 yet, so this is, the, this is it. So I got some uh, goblins over here. I, can, I have two spells at the moment. One is Ice Bolt, which is Q here. You can see this is the range. And I can't, can't shoot, I can only shoot at enemies. So, there we go. 40 damage to that guy and 20 to those around him. And as you might have seen, this they had a little buff or debuff there. So if I do this again, that one dies. So you can see here is all the affected, uh, all the effects that affect the unit. Also fixed melee combat. So if I head in straight for them. You can see he starts, he'll start uh, attacking the enemies. But let's just move away. So I'll show you the second spell, which is Summon uh, Water Elemental. So you can see here I get a different targeting mechanism. So this will uh, make sure there's an open area and the cast range for this is a lot shorter. So let's create our, wa our Water Elemental. There we go, he's a ranged unit with 360 degrees area. But as you saw, he disappears after a while because he's, some, he's a summon unit. So let's move on. Just for fun, let's create. Uh, no. Gotcha. Yeah, let's create. A water elemental there. So I can kill a few of them while I walk around. And as of right now, I haven't added any cooldowns to the spells. I don't think I will either. At least not to most of them. Um, I want it to be. I mean, it's it's a lot of fun just spamming spells. If you have the mana, you can just 
make a crazy amount of damage if you save up some mana. And um, so this is where the limits will be, not the cooldowns. I'll just keep. Let's go into melee and kill these guys. Um, my hero here is very powerful right at the moment in melee combat. <clears throat> so he's pretty much unkillable by these goblins. That might change. Let's get a water in front of him and he can kill us. Soon we will arrive at um, a little goblin village that we created. So I'm gonna save up some mana for that. This guy did his job. Oh yeah, and I've also added this clock, which um, of course changes the time of day. And uh, so now I'm in the middle of the day, so it's a very light. Uh, but earlier here it was a lot darker because it was night. So this is the village. So I'll create or and then I'll save up. Create another one. So you can actually make pretty cool traps. Let's I create a few more goblets. So now if these were more spread out, I could use like the water elemental to group them up like this and then just murder them with the ice bolt. They're also of course slow Everyone in this area will be, will be slowed by the ice ball, slowed by 50%. So if I move this guy here, he's moving very slowly. So I've made it through the entire level. You can see the map here. And that's it. Level clear. Next level will be um, more like Fortify 1 where you defend your castle and you can build units. And uh, we'll see when the next devlog comes up. Um, I think there will be less frequent updates in the future because well, I don't want to give away all the game and uh, um, right now in the beginning I'm just adding a lot of features that that's cool to show off but later when I'm just building mission levels and uh, um, stuff like that I don't think I want to share them right when I make them so We'll see. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.